Vicky, how do I practice JavaScript? I am a beginner. What should I be practicing with JavaScript? How do I be better at manipulating the DOM? So in today's video, I wanted to focus into talking about how to practice in JavaScript. Hello, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Vicky Daily Stand-Ups. Honestly, I remember the time when I'm hitting the wall. I feel like I'm hitting onto a wall. This is how newbies feel. This is how I feel and I want to be honest with you. I definitely feel you if you had the same kind of struggle. And one of the quickest tips that I would give absolutely everyone, super simple, is to make a to-do list. I know it's boring. I know it sounds just so cliche because everyone is telling you to do that. It's not exciting to build. I know, I know, I know. But the key of practicing JavaScript is actually being able to manipulate a DOM, create a to-do list. It doesn't have to be fancy. It doesn't have to be like really super crazy looking. And what you would need to do is a full CRUD, which is create, read, update, and delete. So four actions and being able to do that in the DOM. To-do list is such a huge indicator of understanding how good you are with JavaScript and it helps me so much. By doing to-do list, I don't mean to just do it once. I mean to practice every day and practice every week to the point that when you are when to the point that when someone is telling you to do a to-do list like you don't have to like second think about what to do like you can just right away start floating with all your thoughts and turning it into code like if you're at that level when you feel like your typing is slower than what your mind is when you're creating a to-do list congratulations you are level up um so i hope this video is helpful i got this question a lot and my answer to that is trying to make really simple applications to help you to really level up your javascript and one of the quickest way to do that is be able to create a to-do list and be able to be really good at making a to-do list on the dom I hope this is helpful. What are some of the other tips that you've encountered that really helps you to learn JavaScript? Please leave all the comments down below. I would love to read all the comments and I would love everyone to kind of like start talking about their experience on learning JavaScript. And if you wanted to be part of asking questions, um, please follow me on Instagram and tune in for every weekend. I would be doing a Q&A section, basically just submit your question and I'll try to answer them on the stories on Instagram. This video was supposed to be like super quick, like two minutes, but I think I've exceeded more than two minutes. But I hope it's not too long and you still get the point. Bye.